Hi everyone and welcome to Upload VP. My name is Andrew Watts and in this WordPress tutorial we're gonna learn about this. Hi everyone and welcome to Upload VP. In this tutorial we will have a look at a plugin called Captain Form. So this is a plugin for many different opt-in forms. So today we're gonna have a look at a newsletter uh, opt-in form. So we will have this in the sidebar. So to do this, if you don't have it, you just go to your dashboard, go down to plugins, click on add new, search for captain form and just install this one. I have already installed this and after you have installed it just click on activate and then we go to captain form, click on my forms. So here you can see all of your forms and if you want to create a new one, choose new form. Okay, so this plugin is awesome because you can do so much with it. You can do blank form, contact form, event registration, order form, survey, quiz form, poll form or other forms. So we want to choose uh, this one, other forms. Click on this one and go down to newsletter subscription form. Okay, so this is the basic one. We got email, name, preferred newsletter format. We got activate CAPTA ver verification and a subscribe now button. So you can edit this as much as you want. You can just drag one of these one if you want to have a text box. Just drag it and release. Very easy. But uh, because this is a newsletter form, I want it simple. So I will only have... You can delete this by clicking on the X and choose confirm. So I will only have this email field. I will take away all of these. Okay, so I will only have this email, CAPTCHA and subscribe now. Then we can change the title. Join our newsletter today, like that. And we can edit it. We can make it bold and we can have it in the middle. Click on save. We can also add advanced things like date, address and all of these ones. But in this one we will only have this one. Email, CAPTA and subscribe now. Then we click on settings. Go down to third party apps. So here you can choose the one you want to build your email list with. So I use MailChimp, then I will click on Add. So now they want to have this MailChimp API key. Then we have to go to our MailChimp account, log in and click on your image. Go down to Account, choose Extras, click on API keys, go down and create a new key, okay, so then we will copy this key, just click on copy, go back to your plugin, Captain Form plugin, and just paste it in here. 
click on save okay so now we can choose action so we want to add subscriber use list use the list from Mailchimp upload VP newsletter And you can just add email here, and nothing there, depends on your fields. And choose the email if you want to have email on failure noticed. Then click on save. Okay, so then we go to up to settings, choose notifications. Okay, so here you can add your email where you want to have the notifications. You can edit this one as you like. But we want to look at this one. We can add thank you page or redirects. So you can add this one. Your message has been sent or you can remove this and add your own text. You can also redirect them to a website, a web page, if you want. And you can also do all of these things. But we will not have a look at this right now, because this is a simple tutorial. Then we go to publish. Okay, so now we want to copy this shortcode. Copy. And go to widgets. Go down and find this text widget. This one. Click on add widget. Just add the short code like that. Click on save. And now we can change the position. So we want to have this uh, almost at the top like that then we go and have a look at the website okay so now we have our newsletter form right here in the right sidebar join our newsletter today and just add a email to test it out like that and click on subscribe now and now we got a email that tells us that somebody subscribed to our newsletter form okay then we can go back to the captain form plugin choose my forms so as you can see we have one new subscriber we can go to reports we can add a new report report name click OK okay so now we can add numbers we can also add data table like that then we can click on finished then click on update do you want to update this report yes okay so now we have the report in place we have my email and uh, this will count how many that has made the submission in the form okay so this is how you create a newsletter opt-in form with the captain form plugin for wordpress you can uh, I will leave a link below if you want to read more. You, you can use this as a free
plugin or you can buy a plan if you want to use it for more options. Please uh, share this one if you like this. You can subscribe if you want to see more of my tutorials. I will also cover these ones, the blank form, contact form and event registration and all of these. So please have an awesome day and we will see you in the next tutorial. Bye. Okay everyone, I hope this helped. Please uh, subscribe, leave a comment, make a thumbs up. You can also go to our premium support forum at upload vp.com and uh, we will see you in the next tutorial so have a great day and uh, goodbye